In this video, I am going to share five striking features of Google Workspace that will help to increase productivity and enhance collaborations across different Google applications. First in our list is the new Google Meet experience. Google Meet has a new interface to help make meetings more productive. The new interface is available to all users of Meet, even if we are using a personal Google account to start a call. Familiar controls that can be found scattered on the screen are now all accessible at the bottom. Let's say I would like to share a jam with other participants, like with students. How can we do that using this new interface? With this new experience, whiteboard can be found either by going to the activity symbol or by clicking the more option symbol then selecting whiteboard option. To launch a whiteboard, commonly called a jam, we can either select start a new whiteboard or choose from try. Let's select the first option. To share, go to the share button. In the share box it appears, we can share it to a specific email address or we can set the permission to anyone with the link can edit. The second incredible feature is the ability to replace our background with a video in Google Meet. To do that, click the More option symbol and choose Change Background. In addition to the ability of Meet to set static background images, we can now replace our video preview background with moving graphics. These are the Google Meet videos currently available. Classroom, Party, and forest background videos. This feature is available to all Google Workspace users, even if we are using Google Meet with a personal Google account. The third astounding feature is the ability to cancel noise that isn't speech. This new feature helps in eliminating distractions in our video call. It removes background noises, like sounds produced when typing on the keyboard, the sounds of our pet at home, or the cars outside. To activate noise cancellation, simply go to the More option symbol and select Settings. From the box that appears, select Audio. Then on the right side, click the slider button to turn on. This feature, however, is currently available to Google Workspace Business Standard, Business Plus, Enterprise Essentials, Enterprise Standard, Enterprise Plus, and Education Plus customers only. The fourth amazing feature in our list is the ability to present from Google Docs, Sheets, and Slides directly to Google Meet. For example, to present this Google Docs file to a Meet call, simply click the Present to a Meeting button. This will help us present our file with fewer clicks. We can now also see what is being presented to the participants of the call as the preview of that now appears in Meet. This feature is available to all Google Workspace users, even if we are using Google Meet with a personal Google account. This last but definitely not the least remarkable feature is the ability to insert smart chips for files and meetings. This will enhance collaboration across Google Workspace applications. Inserting smart chips for files and events is like mentioning a person in Google Docs. For example, in this document, simply type in the at symbol and you will be able to type in the name of the person you would like to mention or the file that you would like collaborators to preview. This is available to Google Workspace users. We come to the end of this video. I hope I have given some light to your knowledge about features for better collaborations across Google Workspace applications. Thank you for your time.